Hello and welcome back. This is the week two of WebID and in this section, we are going to go a little deeper on the WebID in the technical aspect. We will see how this WebID will be utilized to integrate with our ERP ECC system, our HCP, the HANA Cloud Platform, SAP Cloud Platform, how we are going to use any service and also build the application. What is the difference? and how to perform those activities. Now, we have a special guest in this series or week two of WebID with us and that special guest is Rabbit. Rabbit will be helping us to understand some of the concept. He was working with me from past few weeks and we have got good understanding on how this actually works in WebID or how are all the features and functionalities for UI5 ABAP and Fury developers to use in WebID. Now I will give a little background about Rabbit. Rabbit has been working with us from past few months and he has got a good proficiency at this point and also there are some of the concept which Rabbit need to understand to be able to work on the WebID. Now so that's the reason why we are calling Rabbit. So Rabbit can also verify whatever I'm saying, if it's correct. And also he will be getting a good opportunity to learn live with me in the spot. So let's get started in understanding one by one, what are the topics we are going to cover within this week. So Rabbit, are you ready? You seems exciting, but did you remember how we configure a open source OData library within HCP. Okay, so you are confused. Okay, not to worry, we will cover that in this section and you will be able to configure that. So anyway, let's join in the section where we are going to go a little deeper and understanding the details for technical developers to start working on WebID for productive use. 